Hi everyone, I'm Lauren and this is my channel, Miss Sunny Gamer. So I have a problem with starting a whole bunch of new series. I'm really bad at just sticking with one and taking it to the end. I'm also just really bad at keeping up with a ongoing series as well, so what happens is I just end up having a lot of series that I'm not finished, but I've started. So uh, today I wanted to talk about some of these series. This won't be a comprehensive list just because there's a lot of series I've started as a kid and I do want to continue with, but I don't remember all of them. So yeah, I, I don't know how this is gonna go. <laughs> let's see. Uh, let's just get started with one of these. The first one I have here is the Wayward Children series by Seanan McGuire. This features a lot of portal worlds and kids running around and doing stuff in these various portal worlds and it's a very unique idea. I really like Every Hearted Doorway which is the first one but I have not read any of the other ones. I think there are like seven novellas so <laughs> I've only read the first one and I really liked it and I've heard a lot of people like some of the other ones, maybe even better than this one. Another one here, it's not as bad that I'm a bit behind, is that uh, this is, I think it's called The Band Series by Nicholas Eames. This is the first book, Kings of the Wild. I've read this one and I really liked it. There's also a sequel called Bloody Rose, which I haven't read yet. <laughs> But thankfully there's no more than that currently. I think there's a third book being written, but at least with this I don't have too much to catch up with. It was just a fun adult fantasy full of nice fun battles and comedy and just general badassery. So I do definitely want to continue on with the second book. This one's not so bad either. <laughs> that is the Riria Revelation series by Michael J. Sullivan. This is the third book, Heir of Navarin, because I don't know why I didn't pick up the first book, but you know, what? whatever. <laughs> I read the first two books in this series, but this is the final one, so at least I'm almost done with this. However, in addition to this series, there's also another series called the Riria Chronicles, and that one has like four or five books in it. And then in the same kind of universe, there's also the first Legends or something like that series. And that one is going to have five books very soon. <laughs> so I have a lot of catching up to do in that sense overall. But it's just real fun romp fantasy. Like, I really like my fun fantasies that aren't too grim. And Hadrian and Royce, the two main characters being badasses, and I just love it, so I am definitely going to continue reading this one and then the subsequent, like, other series in the Usain universe as well. Uh, something slightly different here. Let's see. The, the Iron Druid Chronicles, is what it's called. This is the first one called Hounded, and it's by Ke uh, Kevin Hearn. This one is, what do you call it, urban fantasy, and it stars this Irish guy, and he's immortal, and he has to battle all sorts of gods and goddesses. And another really fun one, this one has a lot of comedy, and it's really silly, and I really loved the first book. There's like seven or eight, and I've only read the first one. Oops. Alright, here's one that's gonna take me a really long time to catch up. That is the uh, Wheel of Time series by Robert Jordan. This is the first one, The Eye of the World. I've only read the first book. <laughs> but it's just shows so many books, uh, and this is very intimidating for a series. But I did really, really love this first book. Just a lot of... I can feel the stuff building up. Apparently, there's more good stuff to come, so I, I do want to read more. Ah. Okay, here's, a, here's another kind of like more newer one that doesn't have that many out yet, but still behind as well. 
and that is uh, Mushoku Tensei Jabo's Reincarnation by Rifujin Magononte. So this is a light novel, it's it's a, I, I wouldn't say classic, but it's a really well-known one in the light novel sector. <laughs> and a lot of people really love it. This first book, this first volume is the only one I've read. I think there's two, maybe three, maybe I'm wrong about that. But I think there's a few more out now. And I do want to give another volume a try. I wasn't super keen on this one because... Like, I didn't really like the main character too much because he gets reborn in this new world as a kid again and he's kind of hard to handle for me. But I've heard it gets a little bit better, so I'll, I think I'll, I think I still want to continue on at least for another volume or two. And these ones are not too thick anyway, so. Alright, this this one I could hardly call I am behind on because I'm only one volume behind and I have it. And it's super new release. And that is Death March to the Parallel World Rhapsody, or you can call it Death March for short, by Hiro Ainana. This is the first volume, and this is so good. My favorite light novel series. Uh, so I only recently got the latest volume, which is number nine, and I'm probably going to read that very soon because this is another really light-hearted romp, lots of battles, lots of cool characters, lots of food, and lots of shenanigans, and that's kind of my favorite thing. <laughs> uh, let's see, here's a very different one. This is another light novel. This this is the Monogatari series by Nisi Oisin. This is the first volume. That is Baka Monogatari Monster Tale Part 1. I've only read two of these, and there's ten. There's at least ten, I'm pretty sure, out right now in English. <laughs> this is a very weird series with most of the time it's talking. It's very clever and witty talking back and forth, but it's not going to be for everyone. But I really enjoy it, and Nisi Oisin's writing is very interesting. And I think it was translated really well as well, so... I really like it. Ah, I'm so far behind. Oh god, I'm, by, I'm really behind on this one as well. This is Spice in Wolf by Isuna Hasakura. This one is another really slow-moving light novel series, and most of it involves... She's a wolf goddess. And the main character, it's been so long that I don't remember his name. And they do a lot of traveling together, and the main character is like a... He goes around different towns and selling things. It's like a medieval type world, and it's a lot of fun, it's really cool. I've only read the first volume, again. And there's like 14 at least. I have so many to catch up with. See, this is why I have a problem. There's just too many. Let's get some more light novels in here. Some more light novels. That time I was reincarnated as a slime by Fuse. This is the first volume. I think I've only read one. Maybe I've read two. See, I don't, I don't remember these things now. Another fun light novel, but why haven't I continued? There's like at least ten volumes currently out. There's too much to read. Similar case here. I've been killing slimes for 300 years and I maxed out my level by Kisetsu Morita. I've only read two volumes and I think there's there's not ten this one. There's like seven or six. That's still a lot. I'm so behind on everything. Another series that I really want to finish. Oh, the Queen Sleeve series. Or I guess I want to continue with it. This is the first book, The Thief, by Megan Will and Turner. So it's been a little while since I read this one, so I don't know the exact plot synopsis. But this one involves a journey and a lot of asshole characters being mean to each other and bickering. And I kind of really like that. I think the other books are, gonna, are a lot different from what I understand, because a lot of people say that they're better than this one, but I really love this one. 
So hopefully that means I really love the next ones. But yeah, there's... I think the seventh book is coming out next year, like in summer. So I really want to catch up so that I can read that book when it comes out, hopefully. So that's another one. Another more classical one. Um, this one, I think it's... I don't know what the series name is. I, it might be The Song of the Lion Lioness by Tamora Pierce. Uh, this is the first book, Alana, the first adventure. I've only read this one. There's four books here. This is a fun... I would call it a middle grade. It has Alana trying to be a knight, even though women aren't allowed to be knights. So she has to pretend to be her twin brother and just her trying to be a knight and there's a lot of hidden stuff going on and it's just so much fun. Ah, there's only four so I don't have too many to catch up on. There's only three books more that I have to read but still this all this adds up. This is, I don't know what this series name is. This is the first book called The Fire Within by Chris DeLacy. This one I'm not super confident about if I want to super continue with it or not. Um, this one ended up mostly being about squirrels and less about dragons. I remember being frustrated about that when I first tried to read this, but um, maybe the other books are better. I don't know. It sounds like they're more focused on dragons, so I want to at least give the second one a go. I think there are ten volumes or nine, so it's a lot to catch up with if I decide to fully finish it, but... The Abhorson series. This is the first book, Sabriel, by Garth Nix. I have read a good number of the Abhorson books, but I read them, like one, I read them a really long time ago, and two, I have not read all of them. I read Sabriel, Lyriel, Abhorson, and Across the Wall, but I have not read Clariel and Golden Hand, and I also have not read, um, there's like a short story compilation. And so I want to reread these ones that I haven't read in a while and then read the ones that I haven't read at all. Another Garth Nix series that I want to finish and continue with is the Key to the Kingdom series. I don't own it, but I borrowed a bunch of them from the library before and I really liked them. Not as many people like that series, but I thought it was really interesting and I really liked it. So There's seven books to that and I think I've only read four, but... I don't remember much that happens in that, so I need to reread it. Another series that I want to continue reading, number one, Ladies Detective Agency by Alexander McCall Smith. I think this is the fourth book, The Kalahari Typing School for Men, and I think there's, there's a ton of books. There's like 12, I don't know. These are fun, kind of cozy mysteries in the Kalahari. And the main character is really good. Actually, a lot of the characters are really good. Just solving various mysteries in her town and the surrounding area, and it's fun. Another light novel series, uh, Overlord. This is the first volume, and it's by Kugane uh, Maruyama. The main character is trying to conquer this new world, and I've read... This one I've read a lot more of. I've read, I've read five volumes. But I think there's like nine out now, so I'm still <laughs> far behind. They're not too thick, but nah, there's so many. The Wandla series by Tony D. Terezi. This is the first book, The Search for Wandla. I read this book, the first one here, a few years ago. Haven't read the other two in the series. There's only three. Let's just let's just give you guys one more series that I haven't fully done yet and I want to continue with. Yeah. And then here's The Lunar Chronicles by Marissa Meyer. This is the first one. Cinder. I have only read Cinder. So, and there are five or six or so. I have ordered the sequel. It's just not here yet because the mail's really being dumb. So that's, that's not even all of the series that I want to catch up with and I'm not caught up with. As you can see, I have a lot of series that I want to catch up with. Hopefully I can catch up with some of these as I put more effort into doing so, but we'll see how that goes. 
Let me know in the comments if any of these series you want me to focus on more uh, than some of the other ones, and maybe I'll direct my attention to more those than some of the other ones. And uh, thank you so much for watching. I hope to see you again for another video. Bye!